Wait a minute. Where am I? And how did I get in here? Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of The Planet Crafter. Uh, as you can see, I have been very, very, very busy. Uh, one of the things I've done, as you can see, is I actually got a couple more uh, Tier 2 algae generators here, because in a moment, you're going to be unlocking something new. I've uh, been trying to rush this, because I've been doing a lot of work off camera. I've been uh, making a whole bunch of tree seeds, been making a whole bunch of different things, and fertilizers and stuff like that, getting ready for... Uh, I was hoping to time it right, but uh, they're tier 2 tree spreader. Uh, we are doing really good on the oxygen. We are almost at 7.5 parts per million. So let's see how we're doing. Alright. That should be just in time. Oh, close. But yes, that is that. Uh, I'll show you what I've done. Uh, one of the things I did do over in the. Uh, the food food area here is I switched one of the mushrooms over to squash because I'm gonna need that for the tier two fertilizer, which I'm pretty sure is for the tier two tree spreader. Kind of makes sense, and then I organized the food a little bit better. I got a uh, container here for mushrooms, one for eggplant, and one for squash. And then in this, it's just seeds. And then go over here, and this is all the trees that I've got made right now. I have another one of these actually in the DNA manipulator. Uh, which should be done. There it is. And then, just in time to tier 2 tree spread it now. I, I'm actually curious at how much this is going to cost. Yeah, tier 2 fertilizer, zeolite. Easy. Easy. I think I actually have some of that zeolite left. Let's actually go check. Get away from that noise. Uh, let's see. Plenty. Okay, now what did I need? I need, uh,. Tier 2 fertilizer, zeolite bacteria sample, that's kind of why I uh, uh, algae, yes, the green stuff, that's why I made the green stuff, had a whole bunch here too, so let's go ahead and take that out, and put this in here, I uh, have the fertilizer as well, so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to get the tier 2 fertilizer made and the bacteria samples and I'll bring you back. Okay, I am back, and I have done a lot of work to get this done. I uh, actually had some stuff I ne didn't realize I needed. Uh, one being more zeolite, and not only do I need more zeolite, but I uh, don't have enough power for this. Uh, I did also find another walnut seed, so I uh, probably won't craft that, but uh, I did have to put a few more food growers in for the squash to get the... Uh, this green stuff, the tier 2 fertilizer. But as you can see, I got the enough for 12. Uh, 12 tree spreaders. I have 12 seeds. Uh, there's the rest of the stuff there. Uh, I do have to do that and uh, the rest of the tree bark should be almost processed. I need two more. And uh, last one will be done in just a minute so I gotta make, make three more crystals. Oops, walked into a tree there. Can make three more crystals but I need, I need uh, let's see if I can remember this. Uh, one, two, three of those. Three of those, and I have three of the zeolite and three of those. Uh, oh yeah, I need the super alloy too. Uh, there we go. Food level. Hmm. Nope, that's not a food cabinet. Uh, hmm. Eat an eggplant. Sure. Growing six of six of them may as well. Okay, but yeah, check that power situation. It is about 540 watts free. These things use 70 apiece. So yeah, we're not gonna have the power for this. So let's see, we got one there. It's kind of cramped. Hmm. Let's see if we can sneak it right in here. Nope. Where shall I put this? Uh, hmm. I could put it right in the right in my way. Uh, I'll put it there for now. So we got the power. All right. So we have everything I need. I have everything I need. All right. So let's go and uh, plant some trees, shall we? Uh, put a few things away. 
Uh, let's see, I need to kick six, six things with me so we can probably plant like five at a time. And what I'm thinking about doing, uh, again, I need those earmuffs. Uh, I'll take five of those. Uh, what I'm thinking about doing is I'm thinking about actually about planting them around the, the big ship over in the desert there. Just for, you know, just for the hell of it. Why not? Make it to a big giant forest. Okay, there's five. That's five. Uh, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we will grab our seeds. I'll just take take whatever I can. Uh, I think I have one more sequence. I I can't remember. Uh, make sure I have everything I need. I do. All right. Gotta drop and grab a drink of water on the way. In. I prefer bottled water, not lake water. Just my thing. Call me a city boy if you want. Anyway. Now, I'm wondering about the tier two, the higher tier tree spreaders. Is it more trees? Is it... Uh, and I just realized something. They have to be on water, don't they? Or is that just a tier one? Oh. Perfect. You know, that's what happens. Sometimes you don't think to check things, and not always it always work out, but this time it did. Okay, let's turn this place into a massive jungle. Yep, to the top we go. And we'll place the first one here. And pick a random seed, put you in there. Go over here, put another one like so, put another seed in, of course I walked into it, why wouldn't I? Okay, and another one, and you get the idea, so let me go fin finish putting the rest of them in and I'll bring you back. Okay, so I got all the trees set up, uh, what I'm gonna do is a uh, uh, weird lighting effect. I'm gonna give it a little bit of time and let everything build up. Um, no, the trees grow, I should say. Uh, what I have done is I made some super alloy. So maybe what we'll do is take advantage... Hang on. That's eight. Nine. Uh, take advantage of the, the excess power that I'm generating and build a few more drills. Just because. And this is like the third time it's rained this episode. First time you've seen, actually. And uh, one of the things I've noticed, I uh, love this about early access games, is uh, the un unexpected... I thought that light helped much. Um, I was collecting algae and it was actually raining underwater. Uh, I think I've had, seen that in a few other games too. So that's one, uh, yeah, tier four drill. Put you there and uh, right there. And the lag is holding up, so we are doing just fine. Uh, what I did notice is the oxygen is just skyrocketing. Like, look at that, what is that? 1.2 million a second. Parts per quadrillion or whatever that is, but that's, that's all doing insane. And look at the biomass just climb to. Uh, not that there's anything in the bio lab, but uh, developers had re released uh, sorry, release an update on Steam. Or, uh, you know, an information update, but there's an update coming up in a couple of weeks. Uh, some new stuff to. Uh, build. There's a map expansion coming, so that's going to be quite interesting. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to let this go for a little bit, and I'll bring you back, and we'll go check and see what kind of check and see what kind of trees we got. And since I planted all those trees, let's launch another seed spreading rocket. Really get that oxygen really cranking. It's quiet this time. Must be a dead. Okay, let's see what that actually did. Wow. That went up to 1.8. That just went crazy. Unfortunately, no goodies from this one. Uh, I have been looking around for vines, too. I don't know if I mentioned that, but uh, over in the canyon area, there's like vines that take you up to the top and finding seeds and stuff like that out there. This doesn't seem like a, a normal kind of storm. Or maybe it is. 
Anyway, I shall return. Okay, I am back, and yes, we've just passed 25G. Uh, just looking at the numbers here, and uh, things honestly could be better if the next unlock, which could be the tier 3 tier sp tree spreader, is at, what was it, 79? 79.5 GTI. we got a long way to go for that. Uh, realistically, I could start building more of these things and using more power and all that stuff, but what I think we got to do is we got to go ahead and start launching a whole bunch of rockets. So I think next episode I'm going to go ahead and do that uh what i'll do sorry what i'll do is between now and the next episode i'll get everything ready and then uh i'm thinking we might try to do three of each three for the three for the oxygen three for the heat three for the pressure and three for the biomass uh we'll have to do the the iridium ones first i did build another heater but uh that's all i have for the iridium and i need one rod for each rocket engine and then the super alloy and what i've done with this super, been doing with the super alloy is whenever i go to the mines to get iridium or sulfur or whatever i just take everything with me and then I'll go over here and grab no, not in there go in here and grab whatever aluminum i need and then i'll just whatever clutters in my inventory and turn it into super alloy and then just start storing the chest but anyways uh, i have taken a little peek and uh i was expecting more but uh it's interesting it's quite something we'll go this way so we can get the big reveal through the sulfur fog uh, it does kind of look it does kind of look kind of cool now you really got to admit that's one thing I do enjoy about this game is how we started with like a barren wasteland just nothing but you know dry river bed or dry lake bed sorry and brown ground now we're getting grass and foliage and blue skies but look at this there we go all the trees I was kind of hoping the tree spreader would have a more r wider range of effect like honestly it could be growing trees m more in I have checked to see if they're still growing these ones aren't uh, I don't know if these smaller ones that are showing up are still growing or if this is the final stage of it but there we go we have our alien jungle around the ship I'm out of I was thinking about building, getting a few more of these out here, just try to get as many trees as I can. Uh, if we're in the tree stage though, like we have been getting grass and flowers show up at these stages, does that mean that uh, I'm going to start seeing trees show up on their own? Well, I guess so, because we did have uh, that ring. You know what, let's go check out the ring, I'll meet you there. Okay, I may be wrong, but I don't think there was that much on there before, not on the top anyways. Um, from what I've heard, that this possibly c could be some sort of, like, Stargate or something. Uh, that's speculation, anyways. Uh, I know there is something going on with these, these power cells. I got a little curious. I want to go check this out, just see what this was all about. It's nothing. But, anyways, let's go head back to our ship. Gotta top up on some oxygen here. Uh, where was my shelter? And right here. Okay, and off we go. It's great, I haven't had a need for an oxygen or water container in so long. It's actually up here. Hmm. Nothing. You never know, I always gotta go explore it. I actually like that. See, there's all these vines that are showing up, like they go up there, and then that's where I've been finding the, the, the volnus plants. Oh, there's a lot of vines. Oh. Interesting. You gotta love that sudden drop. Uh, might go on the right way to the ship. Yes, I am. It's over this way. I'll meet you there. You know, at one point in the game, I used to get lost all the time. And now I pretty much know where I'm going most of the time. Look at that. We have trees. We have also gone up a whole G 1G in, since I placed those tree spreaders down, so that's definitely good. Ooh. Have I looted this yet? Uh, yeah, we might actually need those. Take that. I don't care about the seeds. I don't need to eat. But yeah, I put, placed them on the front here. and I, Did I place any back? I don't think I did. Oh, I did. 
I was hoping they were to go a little taller. But there we go. We just started a little jungle around the ship on our planet we've cr that we I'll say we're destined to terraform. We don't have a choice but to terraform it. That almost looked like I was in there. But with that, I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.